Okay, Ollie, let's check out one of your uh, afternoon stubby solo runs. Watch it in regular motion and slow it down. Lovely. Nice little crash. All right, let's slow it down a little further. Good looking turn there. Brought some shape back to the pole, had direction done. Have some nice angles, fairly level shoulders. Not really that pole plant we're looking for. Pole plant's really gonna help you in your transition um, to move forward, get off the old ski. It's a timing thing. Um, it's kind of tough to get off the old ski. Um, without a pole plan. All right, came through here, the hairpin. Not bad, I'd like to be chinning off those though. Just, just swing yourself out a little more and you just sort of waited too long. Let's get in there and shin those, those guys. Don't be afraid of two poles. Uh, because you didn't really shin them, you were just a hair low on the line here didn't have a strong high exit out of the out of the hairpin with with the proper direction or proper height or elevation so he you know ran straight at this thing and obviously turned well below it still play a little catch up now now we're back in gear here Yeah, pole plant would really help. So you come through here, I'd like to see a pole plant right now. Get off that old downhill ski onto the new and move forward. But you, you didn't, so you're hanging on the ski, hanging, 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 hanging. And very slow in the transition. And therefore just not ready. And you chucked them sideways because you weren't ready. Hit the rut sideways. And that's setting you for a ride. Boom. But, good thing you're okay, and you're right back at it. But, um, you know, we, we, we talk about this every run. We need to get a pole plant. All right, let's see if we can do that.